Today, I am reviewing a Notion template. It is called Notion Freelance OS. We're going to overview what it is, the main features, and a little bit more about it in today's video. So welcome, my name is Francesco, and welcome to Keep Productive. We're gonna dive into lots of productivity applications, so do make sure you are subscribed here on Keep Productive. We'll find a perfect one for you. I'm, I'm definitely sure of that. So Islo is a really well-known creator of Notion templates, and he has served over 100,000 customers so far with his templates. It's pretty impressive seeing his work and how he's done it. So Islo has created this one called Notion Freelance OS, and essentially what it does is it combines projects and tasks with clients and a financial database to be able to manage that process, but it's got a few things in between that I want to talk about in terms of features. So in terms of the project and task abilities, it allows you to manage them pretty easily through a board and be able to coordinate that information. But combine that with some linkage to clients, which is quite an interesting setup. You can set up clients, which are essentially contacts, but the difference is, is you can set up a process with them, things like a questionnaire, be able to uh, capture feedback from them and be able to bring that into a client profile, which is perfect for being able to making sure you don't miss a thing for next time. And finally, you can connect that to a financial setup, which allows you to see any income, revenue, outgoings per project, per client, which is really nice. So this system is really designed for those who are freelancers and those who are working with clients in particular. It'll allow you to coordinate all sort of your, uh, your projects, your tasks and your clients at the same time, but also make sure you don't forget about the finance side and tie them directly, which some systems do forget unless you buy an all-in-one like Bonsai or Honeybook. So there are some really nice abilities here that go a step further, an area for managing goals, a mat area for managing resources, that could be branding, etc. And finally, things like meetings and a portfolio for some of the work that you're collecting when a project is completed. So it tries to think about all of the aspects of being a freelancer and really try and refer and go much further with that in terms of building a structure for you. So that is Freelance OS. It's available by Easelo. You can find the link in the description. Naturally, discover a little bit more. And uh, if you have any questions, you can, of course, reach out to myself. But I hope I helped you find a productivity application, at least on this channel. So do make sure you're subscribed here on Keep Productive. And I'm very excited to be diving into more productivity tools with you all. Cheerio, folks, and have a great week ahead.